Thanksgiving again. Uh, hair's lemony rinsed. And this year, the stereotype against Indigenous people I've decided to confront is water. Uh, see, several times other students, props or whoever, after finding out I grew up on a reserve, will straight up ask me, have straight up asked me, so did you and your people like have to like boil water before you could drink it? Boil your, you know. And the truth is those times I've lied either flat out or and said no, never, um, or said yeah, once, but um, it was only for the summer and then it was sorted. It was three years. Um, see, one of the many mining operations that arbitrages land, reserve land, and including uh, my own <coughs> communities, uh, just dumped a ton of untreated effluent and it took three years for the river to heal itself. And I, I, I fully recognize that, that I and, and my community are, are more fortunate than others, other reserves um, um, <clears throat> in this country. Anyway, uh, towards Towards that, I have resolved to try to stop internalizing the shame that comes with being um, really inhumanely treated, um, but not really being able to do anything about it, and um, disconnecting from my own past to the benefit of those inhumane operators. To horribly. Um, I made a donation to Water First, uh, an organized an NPO that um, works with uh, First Nations towards clean drinking water, and said a prayer for the Sh Shamatwa Nation, who is fighting it out for their water in court, and their case would have um, positive ramifications for um, for other reserve communities whose water security is, water quality is constantly threatened or, or just destroyed. And uh, I hope they win their case because that would be something to be truly thankful for.